the de Broglie wavelength of an electron is the same as that of a photon. Okay. So what is de Broglie wavelength? De Broglie wavelength is lambda is equal to h divided by mv. Now, it is said that of an electron is same as that of photon. So therefore, lambda e is equal to h divided by mass of electron into velocity of electron. It is the same as that of the uh, photon. Okay, and this is equal to lambda of a photon. If velocity of electron is 25% of the velocity of light, then the ratio of kinetic energy of electron and the kinetic energy of photon will be. Okay. Now, this velocity of electron is 25% of the velocity of light. So, therefore, velocity of electron is equal to 25 by 100 into 3 into 10 to the power 8 meter per second. Now, so this is first, this is second. Now what we have to find out? We have to find out the ratio of the kinetic energy of electron and kinetic energy of photon. So kinetic energy of electron will be half Me V e square divided by kinetic energy of photon is H C by lambda. Okay. So therefore this is equal to, um, now let us you know, solve this. So this is equal to half M e v e square now h c by lambda okay so uh, we can see here h by lambda is m e v okay we can see here h by lambda is m e v so i'm writing m e v and uh, multiply it we have to multiply by c so therefore me me is gone v and this is also gone so therefore half into now what is v v is 25 by 100 into c so divide by c gone gone so therefore this is equal to if we can see 25 by 200 which is 1 by 8 so therefore the answer is going to be 1 by 8 okay so what would be done here is this is the kinetic energy of electron this is the kinetic energy of photon kinetic energy of photon is hc by lambda now here what we did was we substituted h because it's already mentioned like this so h by lambda is going to be equal to me v so we substituted h by lambda as me v and then c was remaining so we multiplied it by c okay so that's how we know 